Playing With Fire is a, a real f uh, fun, hilarious family film. Uh, and it's about, uh, it's about a bunch of smoke jumpers who are elite firefighters, these, these guys who literally jump out of planes into the middle of fires. And uh, they discover three children that are in peril and they save them. And, uh, and then after that, uh, they're kind of caught in a, one of those, what would you call it? One of those, uh, I was prepared for anything but this situations. And um, so they, they have to end up kind of raising the kids. The comedy in the film is, is uh, very broad, very physical. And uh, it's, I think that what you really need to make that work and what you really need to pull that off is a director who's willing to allow actors to kind of like, if you want to flip over that chair, go ahead and flip over that chair. And, and, fi and fi finding all the different ways to embolden the actor to go above and beyond to do something physical because you never know what you're going to find. There's always some magic there. And if you're allowed to really go for it, then you have a breadth of stuff that you can pull from when you make the final, the final film. My experience working with John has been, it's been immaculate. <laughs> He's really just the loveliest, loveliest guy. And, and it's, so, it's, it's so interesting when you look at his persona, when he wrestles and who he really is. Um, he, he is a very person who's open to ideas. He's open to learning. He, um, he t he's, a, he's a student of life. He's really, really wonderful. And an extremely well-spoken guy, very generous and polite. And another thing I learned about John Cena, believe it or not, he does eat carbs. Just want everybody to know that. So it's okay to eat carbs, as long as you work out three hours a day. I have learned from working with young children, um, it's a, a little thing, a little attribute, human attribute called patience. Um, it's, it's also I've learned it's as much fun as we have on set, I'm starting to train myself to find those moments where you have to lock in and focus. Um, children learn from adults. So if you lock in and focus, then they will lock in and focus. And it's finding that nice, I've, we've been learning how to find this lovely balance between how much fun and play we can have and how much focus uh, you know, and time that we have to attend to the work. And the kids are fantastic at it. They're really, really good.